What's up, folks? Welcome to the episode of Pokemon Fire Red. Last time, last time I left off, things were a bit different. This time, we're rocking. We're 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 going full Monty, if you will. Uh, three of my guys, three of my guys, I think are up to level 60, uh, 60 plus. We got Ken level 62, same moves as before. Brand level 63, same moves as before. Grinded up Igor off screen. Shout out Igor, Charlie Creator. Uh, he was like level 30, I think we called him. And uh, he knows all the same moves, but we're gonna go in. Polo, he's gonna be the champ of this this victory road run, this Indigo Plateau run, level 64. Korg, not really useful, but he might come in handy. And uh, last but not least, Pharaoh, which he's surprisingly, surprisingly sneakily good, let's just say that. But uh, yeah, in the interim between videos, I did grind everybody up. It took, uh, took quite some time. I'll say we're on, what's our playtime, 38 hours? I didn't play for 38 hours, but with fast forward, I mean, I guess you can estimate what that looks like before and after. Um, you know, let me think. So, so here's what we want to do. Let's lead with this. The way I have it set up right now, what equipment does Pharaoh have? He has, uh, wait, where is his? Black, oh, black, well, really? Black glasses? Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take that from him, and let's put that on him. Uh, you know, as a matter of fact, let's, uh, Oh, let me get back to the capture one. You know how it goes. Let me get back to the capture. Here's what I think. Here's what I think, right? We're gonna say... Let's fly. We're gonna fly back to Celadon City because I want to see something. Oh, junk. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Alright, let's see here. Firo, fly, and Celadon? Alright. Here's one place I don't think I showed off really at all except for the story time that we came here. Oh, this is the game pointer. What I might consider doing, let's see. 500 coins cost $10,000. So I can get exactly 1,000 coins. All right, so we're gonna get 1,000 coins. And, oh, what? Wait. And here you go. All right, so we have 1,000 coins. What you wanna do, go next door. And uh, here's what we're gonna do. We are going to get a Mystic Water for Vaporeon because I don't think I'll actually be able to beat the, the final battle here. I think I can beat the Elite Four. I mean, I know I can beat the Elite Four. It might be close, but we'll see. Uh, I don't know if the Yellow Flu does. Mystic Water? Give me that. Alright. And then, let's go to Bag. Give that junk to Mr. Polo here. And then, I guess we can give the Black Glasses back. Oh, actually, PP up. Give that junk to uh, Igor. No, don't give it to him. What are you doing, boy? Uh, item take and bag. Uh, use. Use that junk on Psychic, because I want that extra PP. Yeah, I want the extra PP. Um, he can have the black glasses. And actually, let me go back into the PC. This is so anticlimactic. I was going to just hop in, start off with the uh, Elite Four. But you know what we got to do? We got to do prep. We got to prep first. Um, let me go back to the PC. We're gonna see if there are any held items, holdable items that we can give our guys because I need to strengthen up their moves. The thing is, our moveset sucks. Like, these dudes, they are trash Pokemon. Um, let's see here. We'll leave some Clint's egg. Oh, that's it? Really? Alright, whatever. Yeah, these, this moveset is so garbage. Like, it's not, it's not gonna get us anywhere. Especially Venusaur. Like, I needed a better grass move than Razor Leaf. Uh, but there are none that I could really come across that would make a difference. Um, I thought of teaching them like Giga Drain, but look, five PP, like I need Mega Drain or something. Solar Beam could be good, but I don't have Sunny Day, uh, so that's kind of pointless. Brick, would Brick Break be? Oh, wait, can anybody learn Shockwave? Nobody can learn Shockwave, right? Yeah, no one can learn Shockwave, all right. Um, Aerial Ace, what about this? Anybody? Korg, hold up. Was there anybody who needed a flying type move? I might get rid of extreme speed. Cause extreme speed, it was useful, but it's not that useful. I will right, we'll hold off because I might teach that while we're in the Elite Four. Just just for just for kicks. Overheat would be nice. As a matter of fact, overheat oh never mind, never mind, never mind. I was thinking if it was uh something else, but it's a special attack, so that's not necessarily the Oh can I buy? Okay, no one's gonna psychic. And then Earthquake? I might teach 
All right, we might teach Earthquake to Bran here. Um, that's about the best thing I can think of to add to his moveset. Uh, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do some of this. All right, cool. Growth, that's special attack, sleep powder. I'm gonna, I might get rid of sleep powder or synthesis. What should I get rid of? Cause synthesis, I'm never gonna use that move. Sleep powder is at least somewhat useful. And I don't even have a special attack to grow, so that's pointless. Um, I'll get rid of growth. Yeah, why not, whatever. All right, he learned Earthquake, great. And then, if we need Solar Beam, maybe we'll get Solar Beam. Uh, nothing else too useful. You can get Ice Beam from this, uh, the Celadon Game Corner, so if you're so inclined, that could be it for you. I'm just gonna rock with Aurora Beam, because that is uh, good enough for my purposes. All right, so let's fly back. And let's go. Okay, so like it never even happened, I should probably just start the video here and then run through everything, but you know, I'm not gonna do that. So we're just gonna head in. We're gonna head on in. Yo, champ of the making. At the Pokemon League. Oh wait, we read this before. Alright, so we're not gonna we're not gonna do that. Uh items? What about items? Don't need ultra balls to revive. How many do I have? Oh, we're all stocked up, we're all stocked up. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Alright, take a deep breath. Well let me talk to this lady first. From here you face the Oh wait, we do we read her? I don't even know. She's a cool trainer. Here we go. I always talk to him from behind. Um, are we ready? Okay, we're ready. We're ready. We're ready. Grand. Welcome to the Pokemon League. I am Lorelei of the Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they're frozen solid. Ha ha ha. Are you ready? I mean, as ready as we're ever going to be. It's, uh... So I, I ran through this, obviously. This is where I grinded. I ran through the Elite Four like crazy. Like, it's not even funny. I kept just, just battling, battling, battling. And these guys are not as easy as Sapphire. Sapphire, they have a lot of exploitable weaknesses. Like, you look at, um, what's his name? The first dude, Sydney. He has dark Pokemon, but they also have, like, grass and other types. So they're really easy to exploit. Not in this game. This game, oh, you got a crit, you got a crit, and a freeze. Okay, good, we're good, we're good. If we get a freeze, I'd be so ticked. Because basically, here's how it works. Brand Volume 2 takes out Dugon, and he's going to take out the next Pokemon. Uh, what's her name? Slowbro. Slowbro's a one-hit. Slowbro's a one-hit quick. As long as Rage Leaf hits... Okay, we're good. That's one hit. That's one hit KO. Alright, we're good. And so now, there's one other Pokemon of hers that Bran Volume 2 can take out, but I don't need him to take, her, take it out, so I'm just gonna rock with him here to get damage on Lapras. And that should do a little more than half, a little less than half, okay, that's, oh, crit? Oh, no, that's not good, that's not good, because she's gonna Ice Beam, and then she's gonna heal that damage up, so that was a waste of a Bran. He's a little too strong now. That's crazy, I should've taken the, I should've taken the uh, thing off of him, because Lapras being Ice type is also weak to fighting. The problem is, she, oh, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. If she heals enough, she won't use the full restore. Oh yeah, we're good. We should be good. Sky, all right, we're good. So now, Ken here, who's holding, I think he has the amulet going so he can make some money off of this. Ken will take out the rest of her Pokemon, assuming he doesn't miss Sky Uppercut, which has happened a few times. Definitely has happened. But Cloyster being Water Ice, Sky Replica, that's one hit KO. Yeah, I didn't realize just how useful Ken's Sky Uppercut. Oh, what? It's not one hit? Oh my god. That's definitely a random number generator. That's definitely a window. Alright, so. Hit for. What, 10 damage? 9 damage? Alright, Thunder Punch? That's fine, because we will get one more Sky Uppercut. And Thunder Punch won't do enough damage to put her into full restore range, so that's nice. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're just gonna go Thunder Punch again, because I don't want to waste uh, Sky Uppercut power points when I could go with Thunder Punch. Oh, protect! He's such a new. All right, just skip past this. I'm so dumb. I didn't want to have to. Are you kidding me? All right, there you go. Okay, so last Pokemon is Jinx, and this 
This guy, this girl, rather, she can really screw you over because she knows what lovely kiss and a track, so she can put you to sleep, and then she can put you under a track. Of course you miss. Of course, no, it's screwed. We're screwed. We're screwed. We're screwed. This is it's over. I might just I might just start this over. I might just start this over because he's in love, and if he doesn't hit here, we're not gonna win this. Yeah. Oh my god, lovely because he's put to sleep, and now it's just. I mean, we can still do this. Don't get me wrong. I'm just gonna spam fast forward. Uh, who can take her out? Probably Firo, honestly. Um, drill pack. He can live. Oh, he can't live that. All right. So this is not what I want to happen. Usually, if if uh, what's its face doesn't miss, if Ken doesn't miss Sky Uppercut, that's a one hit KO because Jinx's defense is so low. This is uh, this is problematic, but not the end of the world because Flame Wheel can definitely take out a low fifty four Jinx. Okay. Alright, and that's one Elite Four member down. I don't know if I'll do them all in one episode, um, but I'm definitely going to heal up because this is just it's just a bad look. I do think it's kind of interesting to give Lorelai here, well she was in the anime as somebody else, she was like some random lady uh, in like the first series of the anime, like the OG anime. She was just like some random woman, it's kind of funny. Um, like, she was still kind of important, but I don't remember her being, like, an elite four member. She was just, like, a, a person. Um, what was I talking about, though? Oh, but all these elite four members, they have their own separate gym music, which is kind of cool. Um, oh, yeah, we're going to just rock, because Brand Volume 2 is pretty good at this. Taking out Broly? Uh, Bruno, there you go. Yeah, we'll grind you down. No, I'm going to grind you down, buddy. But sure messy ponytail and tendrils. It's like it's so hunched over. It's like I'm trying out of that waterfall. Alright, so he has two Onyx, Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and a Machamp. Uh, Bran will take out the two Onyx because he has so much power points PP on Razor Leaf. Those are one-hit KOs. Alright, we're good. And so he should go to Hitmonchan here. Let's see. Uh, yes. Alright, so I'm going to use Igor here. Actually, you know what? No, we're gonna we're switch it up. Let's try Firo because the thing is, Firo can take out both these guys with his drill pack. I think he has before. I don't know if it was like random number generator kicking in or if it was just strong enough. Hold your breath, hold your breath. Yeah, not, not just a little off. He's gonna get Rock Tomb off. I'm slower. I probably should have gone Fly first, maybe. Um, he's gonna kill me because he has Thunder Punch, I believe. Or, or not. If I can get a crit here, we're good. But if I can't get a crit, then we're not good. Usually, I put in a... Uh, what's his name? Oh, let's go! Let's go. We're there. We're here. Alright, so level up. This game has made me realize just how poor the move pools are. You know what? Let's stick with Firo. He's, he's slower, so he's probably going to get hit here. Oh, no. Alright. Yeah, usually I go, um, Hitmon, whatever, or, or what's his name? Igor. I put in Hypno and throw him out here. And he can live through Hitmon Chan, Hitmon Lee, Hitmon anybody. Alright, hopefully this isn't low enough where he's going to heal. This is probably really stupid. Okay, if I, as, long, as long as I go faster, as long as, long as I'm faster than Machamp, we're good here. Yes, alright. Should be, should be good. Should be good, should be good, should be good. Alright, we're cool. The thing is, the reason why I didn't want to use Igor is because I need him for the next matchup. Agatha, with her ghost types, she... Like, I need him to take out a Gengar and a Haunter, and potentially Arbok. I don't necessarily need it with Arbok. Alright, let's go. That's the other thing about this. Mega Kick, it misses so much, and if I can get him to miss one Mega Kick, I can survive the second one, and get off the second, uh... Psychic. And his special defense lower, and that's even better. Okay. I'm tempted to throw in Ken, because I want that extra money from the amulet coin he has. And, you know, I might just do that. I mean... 
Yeah, I don't need this many sky uppercuts. I can I can waste if he misses I'll switch to somebody else, but I can waste one sky uppercut on Onyx just to get the extra money. And alright. Okay, and defeated Elite Four Bruno. Alright, we're making good time, making good time, decent time. And you know what? I think he's such a pally little guy. Like every time you talk to him, he just turns. Like he's like, nah, I don't wanna look at you. I don't wanna look at you. I don't wanna look at you. Alright, so what we're gonna do. I'm gonna heal up. I'm gonna actually call it quits here. We're gonna do a shorter part. I wanna strategize, I wanna get ready, I wanna make sure that what I'm gonna do is gonna work. So we're gonna call it quits here, and uh, in the next episode, we'll come back, take on Agatha. I'll actually leave off in her room so that we can have some suspense. We can build the suspense. I do like how he has the rocket theme though, it's kinda cool. It's not really fitting, but it's it's a pretty good uh, boss theme, so to speak. And of course, Agatha here has the, uh, what you call it, theme. Uh, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. Oh, you can't, okay, you can walk through those. Uh, Lavender Town, Lavender Tower theme, Lavender Town theme, whatever, it's cool. Alright, so next time we're going to come back, take on Agatha, and uh, hopefully take on the next member of the Elite Four as well. As always, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.